Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. So you tried opening ChatGPT, and suddenly this message pops up. Our system has detected unusual activity from your system. Please try again later. It looks serious, maybe even a little scary, but you're not the only one seeing it, and this video will walk you through exactly how to fix it. Make sure you watch till the end. Skipping a single step might leave the error hanging around. Let's get into it. First, Open your phone's settings, then tap on Wi-Fi and mobile services. Make sure you're connected to the internet. A stable connection matters here. Now here's the part most people miss. If you're not using a VPN, try connecting to one. Sometimes this error happens because your IP address got temporarily flagged, and switching networks or regions with a VPN can bypass that. Already using a VPN? Try disconnecting it and reconnecting to your normal Wi-Fi. Test both because sometimes VPNs help, and other times they cause the block. Now, still in settings, scroll down to Apps or App Management and find ChatGPT. Tap it and then tap on Permissions. Go ahead and enable all permissions, especially anything related to internet access, storage, or network. These are important for the app to work properly, and missing one can trigger that error. iPhone users do this too. If you're on iPhone, go back to your main settings, Tap General, then tap iPhone Storage. Scroll until you find ChatGPT, tap on it, and select Offload App. After that, tap Reinstall App. This clears the cache without deleting your data. Perfect for resolving stuck errors. Now update the app. Next, open your App Store or Play Store on Android. Search for ChatGPT, and if you see an Update button, tap it. An outdated version of the app could easily be the reason behind the issue, so don't skip this step. Now that everything's refreshed, try reconnecting to your VPN if it helped earlier. Then open ChatGPT, type something like, write an intro for a YouTube channel. If it responds normally and the error doesn't pop up, congratulations, your issue is fixed. That's it. A few small steps that make a big difference. And now, you can go back to using ChatGPT without that annoying error getting in your way. If this video helped you out, go ahead and tap the like button, and if you haven't yet, hit subscribe so you don't miss out on future tech fixes like this one. Drop a comment if you've got questions, or let me know what tutorial you want to see next. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.